Tonight, we are learning new information about the man bit by a shark while swimming at a Del Mar beach this morning. Right now, a stretch of that beach is closed to swimmers and surfers, and it's going to remain that way for the next couple of days. CBSA's Alex Lai joins us now in studio with the very latest details. Alex? Yeah, Steve, the man was bitten multiple times by a shark while swimming this morning at Del Mar Beach. Officials say he went to Scripps Memorial La Jolla for his significant but not life-threatening injuries. Now a member of his swim group tells CBS 8 he is recovering from surgery. It happened just before 9 a.m. The 46-year-old man was swimming in a group about 100 yards offshore. From what I've heard, based on the description, the person was bitten kind of around the chest and then uh, got bumped first and was bit and then tried to push the shark off and in trying to push the shark off or fend the shark off and hit it in the nose, got injured in the hand. So that resulted in a laceration and some bleeding. The man was training with a swim group, the North County Ocean Swimmers, that often swims at Del Mar Beach. A member of the group out in the water today tells CBS 8 the man was taken to shore by two other swimmers and a surfer who used his board as a gurney. Jenna Veal says today was a worst nightmare day. I mean, I'm truly astounded at his bravery and courage and strength because despite being completely lacerated by a shark, he had both hands in the air and was calling for help. He saved his own life first and foremost, and then I turned towards the shore and I started yelling for help. Over the next few days, the Shark Lab and Del Mar lifeguards will monitor the area. We're also doing water samplings that we're working with Shark Lab on that to look at you know, DNA analysis, potentially, if we can get that. Look at what else what else was in the water, if there's, like, food sources, things like that. Another person was bit in the thigh by a shark at the same beach back in 2022, although officials say it's not a common occurrence. This is the only two bites that we know of, of juvenile white sharks at aggregation sites in the last 10 years of us monitoring these aggregation sites where we've literally tagged hundreds of sharks. So I think people do have to keep in mind that, you know, these incidents are years apart and, and people do remember because they are kind of traumatic. Although Veal says they know the risk when swimming in the ocean. We are very aware and calculate the fact that we're swimming in open ocean water. It's not like we're in a pool. We know we're in um, the home of, of Mother Nature. Right now, Del Mar Beach is closed to swimmers and surfers from 6th Street to North Beach until Tuesday at 9 a.m. while the Shark Lab and Del Mar lifeguards monitor the area. Amazing how calm that victim stayed, Alex. Thank you. The